Well, what do you think? Yeah, it's cool, but man, I already got one. I don't know if I, I really don't think I need another one. Well, my price is a little high, I know, but go ahead and make me an offer. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'd make you an offer, but I don't want to insult you. Go ahead and insult me. I really need it gone. I could make it go away for a thousand dollars. I could let it go for two thousand uh, dollars. I could get it gone for fifteen hundred. Yeah, I can take fifteen hundred for it. Cool, we got a deal. Hey! I bought another one. Yeah, no, I don't know why I'm stupid. So, it's my mom's fault. She dropped me on my head when I was a kid. Jesus Christ. I get one more. If it's a Ford, I got the whole set. Two more and I can open my own trailer park. Jeez. We'll, we'll start with this good. Forty engine, four barrel, California emissions. So that was good, good, and ugly. However, lack of a smog pump. It's not a lean burn carburetor. I'll show you that on the inside. Distributor's not locked out, and there's no cats on it. So this thing has been uncalifornied. It's got a new battery, which is nice. The uh, tires are new. They're 2020 tires, so they're only a couple years old. They're 16 fives, and you can't get those anymore, so these are trailer tires. And uh, they're good. I don't have to replace them. Coming back here. Don't know if you can see it or not. There is an enormous propane tank under there, and it is full. So I'm getting it with a brand new full tank on it. And it's pretty big. So that's good. There's only one, uh, one little spot where there might be some water damage. I think it's coming around from back here. I'm pretty sure the water's getting in here. It ran down the bathroom is right on the other side of that window and down in the corner, down there on the inside, there's a little bit of water damage. And then come around here, we can't get there, but way up there is a uh, empty generator rack for an Onan generator. So that'll go on it too and it will be completely self-sufficient. Coming back around. The ugly. Let's see. All right. That's the dipstick tube for the trans. The thing does not pull at all. Now we're thinking that the reason that it doesn't pull is because cold, without engine running or anything, it is way, way, way low. So I'm almost certain that what happened is the torque converter drained down because it's showing that it is. It's at the full mark on the dipstick tube, but it shouldn't be there from just sitting. So the fact that it's only at full after the torque converter drained down, it's going to be way low when we fire it up. So we've brought some trans fluid and we're going to see if we can't drive this thing home. I'll do a full tour later, but this is part of the good. That seat in all of its 70s glory is actually in fantastic shape. And uh, we got the bead macrame seat thing. Uh, got a 70 spec thermo quad that is not the California emissions T quad, which is nice. Uh, one thing it's got, hard to see here, cracked exhaust manifold. 
So the nice thing is, is that uh, for $279, I can get brand new exhaust manifolds for this thing. And that's where we are. Uh, I tested, well, I, I did a test start when I came and looked at it. And after getting the carb primed, it fired right up. So, yeah. And I'll give you guys a walk around tour. Uh, not this trip, but the next one. The next time that uh, I do something with it after I get it home. Okay, we're going to fire it up. Uh, I'd like you to observe the fluid that went completely away. Alright, so this is the second time we did this, we forgot to record it on the first one. Put it in a neutral, we let it sit and idle for a little while, and now, I want you to hear it. So it's under load, it's loaded up on drive, it's loaded up on reverse. Pretty sure it'll drive home.